God bless you, sir. Amen. Mark chapter 6, verse 2. Amen. So our team of the of Zion 2022. Wow. Mark chapter 6, verse 2. Tell them, let me not send my angel there to switch off everything. I can send my angel there to switch off everything, and I'm standing here. You know, everything can go off. So it's okay, spare them. Let me have mercy because I want to, to see Oliver focusing this afternoon. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Mark chapter 6, verse 2. It says, and the Sabbath day, what? Was what? Where are, you, what, where are you, sir? Are we in the book of Mark? Or what am I reading? Hallelujah. Yeah. The battery level has gone to what percent? Hallelujah. Mark, Mark chapter 6, verse 2. <laughs> Amen. Are we in the book of Mark? <laughs> you, hallelujah. If I just shout aloud, Amen. Amen. What does it say? Mm hmm. Uh huh. Were astonished. Amen. Yes. Mm. Wow. Today I'll be teaching that what wisdom is this that soul winning but divine idea? Divine what? May you enjoy divine ideas after this. I am. Hallelujah. Wow. We have good ideas, amen. We have good what? So wisdom is not about an idea. Again, I'm talking about divine idea. I'm not talking about an idea. No, you can have an idea. An idea is not the same as divine idea. Okay, someone is asking what is then a divine idea? Divine idea is inspiration. It's called what? Inspiration. Like that song was an inspiration. Hallelujah. It was not an idea. Mimi Bawabu, amen. Mimi Mjensi. Amen. Uh, hallelujah. It's, a, it's an inspiration. Hallelujah. A bad idea is not an inspiration. Don't say, I'm inspired. No. That's why you, people go to motivation speakers and they think they can build a wall. And then they live there and they realize they have nothing to build a wall. No motivation speakers can make you feel like you're on the top of the world. You just do this. Those are just ideas, my friend. <laughs> Amen. They bring motivation speakers to children in school and children think they will become number one. It's like what let me tell you what an idea is. Like watching Kung Fu. Like the way a Kirapa used to watch Chaki Chan and think now she can fight when she comes as there. You wouldn't fight, my friend. That's an idea you're having. Are we clear? That's not an idea. If you don't have an idea, you don't have an idea. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. An idea is like an idea is like a bubble. Amen. You think you, you think you have it, but you don't have anything. You think you got it, but you never got anything. Hallelujah. But soul winning makes you have what you call inspiration. Makes you have what you call. And I say wisdom is not an idea. It's about what results. That's why they ask, what wisdom is this? Jesus had an inspiration when he was teaching the word of God. Heaven was talking to him. He knew what to do. He knew what to, to do. The results Jesus commanded was never seen or heard of and by itself brought turbulence in the mind of people. What we are doing here is what will make people come. That's what I'm saying. And next year, our project is to finish the change, changing the chairs. Hallelujah. And I want to put good lights for the youths. Amen. I want to put smoke machines. Remove all this. Hallelujah. Get good piano, good drum set. Hallelujah. Get a bass guitar. So I hope we'll be having bass guitar being played. Hallelujah. When someone can say, wow, that church. Hallelujah. Dickens can play a bass guitar. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. We show him. It's only four strings. If you can't learn four strings, you don't know what you're doing in engineering. Amen. <laughs> Wow, amen. 
go to the children's church, they will have that screen, the carpet will be changed. Hallelujah. They have done keyboard instruments. Hallelujah. It's the divine idea. It's an inspiration. So they ask God, how can I grow? And your brain has been thinking a lot of things. You don't get anything. Now, an idea, when I have a divine, I have a divine idea. 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 I Inspiration. That's why Nikifunza unashanga. Hey, yes, jai soma. Like you unasoma anga kila sa. Yes, jai yona. Like you unayona anga kila waka. It is because it's not. I'm not writing the teaching by voice on an idea. It is I on an idea, wisdom. No. I don't go look for a book to write about the teachings. I depend on the Holy Spirit to give me inspiration. Hallelujah. Inspiration is what makes you arrange your business in a way no one has ever arranged it. Are we clear? Every year, like this, means you'll be starting a business. Amen. Every year. Last year we started a business. This year we started a business. Last year we started a business. Next year we started a business. I already know which business we are starting. Hallelujah. Inspiration. Inspiration. Hallelujah. So imagine by the time this ministry clocks 40, how many businesses will we have? Imagine. Every year. We'll be very rich people. Is it true? Even if we love airline business, hallelujah. Amen. You'll be seeing SM Airlines, hallelujah. Amen. Going to China, going to Dubai, hallelujah. And someone will be the pilot there, someone will be the CEO there. Is it true? Yeah, wow. Oh, you don't believe? believe Wait till you see us in transport industry very soon, hallelujah. We are warming up, we are engaging ourselves, but we're depending on divine ID. We one day we'll have a radio station. Hallelujah. Amen. They say, hi, I'm your presenter, Charles Dickens. Call it from ASM for a morning show. Hallelujah. Amen. Four o'clock in the morning. Amen. 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 And let us pray. Father! Hallelujah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hallelujah. That's called inspiration. Hallelujah. It's called inspiration. Amen. <laughs> it's called inspiration. I tell you, it will be so interesting. We'll one day have our own TV show. Hallelujah. And Salome will host it for us. Hallelujah. We'll come, we'll interview those people there. Is it true? Wow. Justine will be there. She'll be the scriptwriter. She don't be writing. Say that grammar is not correct. Change the pronoun and the noun. And interchange the noun and the pronoun to form an interface of the noun and the pronoun. Aye. We'll be saying, like, this English is too much. Amen. Mm. He will tell you, do you know there are types of nouns? Hallelujah. You forgot that one. Is it true? B does not come before there. And there does not come before B. So you wonder which B are you talking about there? And there which? Eh, seriously. But it takes inspiration. May we enjoy that inspiration in Jesus' name. Now, inspiration is what makes you start what normal people cannot start. Are we clear? Inspiration is what makes you do what people normal people do, but yours is different. Yours is what? The wisdom is contacted by divine download. Tell me about divine download. Ni download ni ni semaje. Ni kitu inakuja kwako. Yenye uwezi elewa ni kama fikira hapako unaona. Unaona unaanza kusema ah naiona. I can see it very well. Do you know one day I was standing in this relia over one year ago. I think I was with the ladies here washing and one of us I told them down here can come with a very good restaurant. So guys, when they start a restaurant, eh? they never listened. Someone came and opened a restaurant. I said it. Because I was just standing there and looking at the rail down. And I said, and I, and I, and I went home and I said, I told some people to start the restaurant. I hope they will start. They never started. But someone has come behind. I said the restaurant is doing very well. Is it true? I said, potential is here. I said, potential. There's a lot of potential here. That was something that came into me and I said, Mto kianza wabi ashana tasonga mbe? No one started. Some people have come after them. Now they are making money. It's called inspiration. Ministry or life is not built only on knowledge. Are we clear? Not only on what? So tikuna ya imamambo. Luke chapter 21 verse 15. Look at this. Inspiration, have you Inspiration will make the people in technical do things that normal people don't do. Have you clear? Inspiration. I'm telling the truth. 
inspiration. Do you know this? Do you see these people pay, 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 take photographs? I know someone who's paying photographs and paying half a million for taking a photograph. I was reading the person who makes suits for the president. It's a suit. It's a contract, yes. You are quiet. That's a life. That's a name. What are you doing with your life? <laughs> it's called inspiration. Inspire? What Andy told us he answered in that office was inspiration. Are we clear? He did not read anywhere. Are we clear? Inspiration came? Luke 21, verse 15. For I'll give you what? And a what? Which all your what? Remember the word all. Like no one will beat on it. Shall not be able to gain say nor what? The ministry must run with this inspiration. Not only at the ideas we can do church growth this way. You have seen I came with families. I, if, you have, if you have been around there, you see a lot of rotation. Kuna kitu ingine nakuja, ingine nakuja, ingine nakuja. Slowly and slowly. That one saw that one saw one day to be very big. Wait and see. I, I know one day to be done to be a very serious concert. Hallelujah. Very serious. I know I'm working around it. It's called strategy, inspiration. Because I was asking God, how do you insult? He told me this is what you should do. This is what you should do. It takes inspiration to make you come up with a product no one has. Are we clear? Yes, yes. Anything we see that was happening right now, anything you're using, it was an inspiration someone was using. Are we clear? May God give you that wisdom. So the wisdom of soul willing cultivates divine ideas in man. The wisdom of soul willing does what? Because to talk to a person, you must be inspired. Are we clear? Yes. You cannot talk to a person because of an idea. Someone can tell you your idea is boring. <laughs> Unless you're inspired, you cannot talk to someone. What will make Arnold come and sit and listen to me is not ideas. Are we clear? It's inspiration. I pray you shall tap on the inspiration in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. I pray you shall tap on it in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. So the name given to divine idea is called what? Inspiration. Tell me about inspiration. So inspiration is different from an idea. Amen. You want to be a good fashion designer. I tell you, you can use me. You can just be dressing me and tell people that that's my product. Make sure you put your label in your clothes. Amen. Just say Henry Joa designs. Hallelujah. It's as simple as that. You know, say, why are you wearing? I say, I'm wearing Henry Juma. Yeah, It's as simple as that. So say, I love your suit. So how do I get it? Call Henry Juma. I'm serious. It's, it sounds like that. It's called inspire. Your artwork. People will come and say, who did this artwork? We say, this is the person. It's, I'm telling you, inspiration is very powerful. Amen? I pray you shall get in Jesus' name. So now, inspiration is a divine influence. Is that what? Divine. Inspiration is what in Swahili? I'm looking for the word inspiration. So I'm not getting it. That's why you talk for that. Let's say Eh? Motisha? No, that is motivation. Uh, inspiration. What is inspiration? Google. What Google? Google me. Amen. Who can inspiration in this one? Yani nikitu. How do I say inspiration in Swahili? There is no word in, in Swahili for inspiration. Yeah? What must you show? There's something that pulls you that was the eleven in India. Nella, kitu ni akupeleka palu. Me inga pali tu kapata kitu kona tafuta. No kona juu kona takupiti apo. I don't know how to say it. It happens to me a lot. You you just feel like let me go sit here and you sit there and then you see something that you wanted to see all that time. It's an inspiration. It's a comes kumo to you in semaji, and that's what you get because when you're talking to someone. Ni kama sai ni kuje niambie tisa kuje wa ubiri. Anaambia hai. Ni ubiri ni you understand? 
it will take inspiration for her to teach. Is it true? Not ideas. Kuna msukumo ndani yako. Inakufikisha pale fulani? Hallelujah. Wow. May you get there in Jesus name. So, inspiration is a divine influence that makes normal man communicate unique actions. Communicate what? Inafanya mtu wa kawaida anafanya mambo zenye watu wengine zifanya. Ndio maana walikuwa nasema kwani huyu ni Mungu amekuja kati yetu wakiangalia Paulo. Is he a god? Amen. I pray as we engage in the wisdom of soul winning, inspiration will be cultivated in us in Jesus name. So, jifuze kwenda kufanya evangelism. Learn how to talk because unaweza fika hapo mtakulize swali. Kama Mungu yuko. Eh? Kama Mungu yuko. Mbona si menyu wale? Tajibu aje hiyo. Mwezo sale ujinga. Ukaria lazima tatu kwa mrefu. Go for evangelism then you can know how you can be dependent towards inspiration. Someone will ask you something very interesting. Someone will ask you mesema tusikunywe na Biblia imeandikwa hapo. Yesu alikunywa siku ya mwisho na akavunja mkate akakunywa na watu wake 12. <laughs> Wote walilewa paka che. <laughs> If you don't have inspiration, you will never answer that question. Is it true? Uh, amen. Uh, I remember some of us when they started me, some of them asked me, that you are saying we should not drink. And Paul told Timothy, take wine for their stomach's sake. <laughs> but I have an answer. I have an answer. Amen. It takes inspiration. That one, you have no book that you can copy. Are we clear? Ni mawazo yenye mtoto anaweza kuuza kitu paka ushinde kuji. Wewe mtoto ameweza kuuza swali? Umeniambia nisimama hapa mbona umesimama? Utamjibu wengine tunakasirikanga wewe toka hapa na kutwanga. No, you don't do that. You might need inspiration to answer that kwa you unahitaji umesema inaitwa msukumo. Msukumo fulani. That is what normal people don't do. Are we clear? I'm telling you, next year we will grow this church by inspiration. It has nothing only just to do with ideas. Are we clear? Or preaching the word. And Jesus had a lot of inspirations. He was inspired all the time. Solomon was inspired all the time. Hallelujah. Proverbs chapter 8 verse 12. Metali nane kuminambili. So, ukiaza kufuta moyo kanisani, you will develop the spirit of inspiration. When you wenda mjuku kuongelesha watu sababu mjuku mtasema nini then it means you lack inspiration you want to develop inspiration in you know how to talk to people are we clear mm. jifuze kwenda kuambia watu ninataka kuja church akuze swali moja nyingine ngumu then waambie Mungu nakutegemea nijibu hii swali you will realize you are developing inspiration in you are we clear yeah utaona maarifa zingine zinaanza kuja yenye ujaifikiria hata utaenda kwa chini useme ni mimi nimejibu hiyo swali umaiongea na mtu paka ukajiuliza ni mimi niliongea hiyo Eh, ni mimi niliambia mtu hiyo kitu. Eh, na hiyo hiyo wisdom nimetoka wapi? The day I tell you to come and preach here, you wonder how you got the teaching. Inspiration. That day even you read a lot, listen to what the message unasema hii message yaingi. Unasoma hiyo ingi, unasema acha niandike yeye najua. You depend on inspiration. In God, you get inspired. You come na like tunasema. Yes. Proverbs 8:12. Yasema nini? I will the mot and find out knowledge of it hiyo yani una, unakuwa creative unajenga kitu yenye iko haleluya unafanya mambo yenye fanywi because there is an in, inspiration unaweza kaatu pale hivi useme nikianza hii kitu hivi nitaenda mbali na unaanza na unaenda mbali kabisa inaitwa inspiration but you only learn inspiration about learning to win people to church telling them about god Tell them come to church. Let them ask those tough questions. Then depend on God. You'll be surprised what can happen. Are we clear? It's like saying, Kevin, come here and present for us a song. Uh -huh. That's a, it's, you need to, don't be afraid. Allow the inspiration to come. Mm. 
Mna elek nasema, you need to allow inspiration. Inspiration. So inventions are generated when we apply ourselves to this wisdom of soul winning. Wisdom of what? Soul winning. Amen? Umaika na mtoto mdogo maya napanda kulia. Analia tuburi. You will be very inspired on how to make them keep quiet. Is it true? So what you always bambia nyamaza? Unabalusha me. Like for me, I know how to handle my boy. I always know how to handle my boy. I always know how to handle my boy. I always know. Yes, it's true. Walikuwa hapa during wiki conference. Anza kulialia lia hapa. Nili mchukua tukenda kapo na ye. Nika mnalisha ni kasa kuchapa tu vidole zangu. Aka focus na vidole zangu. Nika mpea katisa nao. Nika pata mpame. Amelala. Hallelujah. You understand? Inspiration. You need inspiration? If you don't have inspiration, you cannot reach the best of your life. That's why you cannot amend a shule and abandon the maski. I don't know if you understand. Now, kuna my agenda shule, like in the Tajiri, Paco Nazanga, Quan do you tell the pity of happy? Nikonagana lipitia. Alikuja Kakovuka, Vu. This church to grow to one level of another, we need everyone here to be working in inspiration. Inspire? And you get that by soul winning. Soul winning. Soul winning. Hallelujah. Ecclesiastes chapter 7 verse 29. Mubiri Saba. Ishii Natisa. I pray we may be the first in Jesus mighty name. Please I want you to engage in the platform of soul winning next year. Hallelujah. It will develop inspire. Uya ki ukata ongea na mungine. Utajua sasa kuongea. Utajua kupambana na vitu. Soul willing develop inspiration. Are we clear? Ecclesiastes 7.29. Don't be afraid. It's a law. This only have I what? That God has made man what? But they have sought out what? It is out of men inventions come. Inventions don't come from heaven. God has an invention but it's from you. Unless you allow God to work through you, you will no more get it. Jiko kwa ili toka wapi? So mtu lika chida kafikira vya atasevi makasi, ndiyo? That is soul winning. Every time you think about winning a soul, you will come up with the idea. If you want this house to be full, you will sit down and allow God to use you as an inspiration. Are we clear? If you want men here, if you want women, it only takes inspiration. You will draw them. I'm telling the truth. Hallelujah. Inspiration. So, inventions are for men. And we should start being conscious of the ability through the spirit of wisdom. The world is a ground with raw materials. With what? Hii dunia kuna raw materials nyingi sana. Created by God. Only when we tap on the wisdom of inspiration is when we can invent something. Are we clear? Are everywhere around you there's a raw material. Do you know that? There's a raw material everywhere around you. Kuna kitu unaweza tumia usonge mbele. Niza pata majirani stimao inapotea kila wakati. Unelewa? You provide solution for the electricity problem. Nana liona kwa TV ule mwenye ametangiza stima kupitia cho. He has used the toilet to produce electricity in his family. Kwa mpa wala to the village. Yo hit ya cho. Nina peta sti. Na kuna mtu ameka kwa giza. Niambi ameka. Ameka transformer. Eh? Kwa cho. Nina peta stima ina supply kote. Ana charge nyumba. Ana charge simu. Wow. Inspiration. Na kuna watu na shina wanasema Kenya power metukatia simu. You need inspiration. Are we clear? So, if you don't succeed, it's because you have not developed this part of inspiration. That's why soul winning 
develops inspiration inside you. Usabu kwa ngea na mtu sora isi. Mnajwa hivyo. Talking to people is not easy. Kwa mbia mtu kuja kanisa ni. Mnajwa hivyo. Kwa mbia hivyo. Hey, tuachane tafadhali. Mimi na kanisa. Ni kama majina. Mafuta. Tuachane tu. By talking to that person until you convict them. It will need inspiration. How can I talk to this person? How can I talk to this person? So everywhere you there is a raw material. I pray you tap on it in Jesus mighty name. So wisdom for soul willing bring us to the platform of inspiration that leads to inventions. That leads to what? Inventions. Like I read a lot, I check, even I know the day we start building, how we'll be so self-reliant. I know that. We'll be so self-reliant. You will not spend any money outside. The way we are spending money like this. This is we are spending a lot of money here. Uh, and because I'm thinking about soul, I'm thinking if Maxwell come, what will Maxwell love? Ah. That's how I think. So I want to get to Maxwell. Then I get an inspiration. Uh, if you start thinking how you'll draw your friend to church here, I'm telling the truth, you will get an inspiration. The day you start thinking, the letter of Kiyangu Kanisani, you will get an inspiration. Do you know that is the hardest part? Thinking on how you can bring someone to church. I pray the Lord will help us in Jesus' name. First Corinthians 2 9. So, soul winning develops inspiration capacity inside you. Are we clear? If you can win 10 souls next year, you will have 10 formulas of inspiration. Hallelujah. Uh. Amen. First Corinthians, please. Chapter 2, verse 9. May the Lord inspire you in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. What does the Bible say? But it's written what? I as what? what? Nor, nor the things. So where is it then? Where are those things that you have not seen? Where are those things that you have never heard? Where are those things that you have never gone to the heart of men? They are in people. The man you day you win people, you will get the things you have never seen. Are we clear? You will hear what you have never heard. Do you know a business and idea can come from the soul you are winning? A business idea. The man who came with butter, you know butter slippers? Yeah? There were two friends. They went to India. They came to Africa. When they went to India, they say, why are the people wearing walking barefoot? Mm. One of his friends said, let us make some rubber that they can wear. Some what? So they took a simple way, slippers. You see the way you put the kamba? That's how they made it. And you know India has a lot of people. Is it true? That's how they became billionaires. That's why butter is everywhere in the world. They saw someone's leg. Someone's leg became business. How many legs do you see? And how many business do you see? <laughs> if everyone here can start thinking, how can I bring my friend to church? You will have a lot of ideas that the church can do. And that is called inspiration. So soul winning develops the eye you have never had. Soul winning develops your ear to hear things that you have never had. Soul winning makes you your heart to have things that have never been there. The person who came with Facebook or technology or computer and everything, they saw a need. Is it true? They saw man struggling. How did mobile phones come? Because long time ago there's wires. Is it true? Someone said there is, it will reach a time someone will need to walk with a phone in their paw. Then people started working towards it. And I'm telling you the truth, it will reach a time there will be no phones here like this. Have you seen the ear pieces are coming? People, know, people will be using their watch and their phone. Nowadays, I was, I was watching something that thing that nowadays, what do you call these things that people watch videos with? Um, these things that I wanted to buy here. What was it called? For, for enlarging videos. Projector. But I saw nowadays people have come with something that you just put your phone, put it in front here and enlarge it. So the projector will come to an end. I was so impressed. Simu. Unaka to simu if you enlarge. Inakuwa kubata kuliko projector. 
and the clarity is so good. It means somehow so mtu atashinda na bag ya projector mimi bana projector hivi. Anasema my friend acha na ibaya my friend. Wewe beba kitu kidogo enda onyeshe video yako na wewe. It's called inspiration. Are we clear? Inspiration. How do they form glass? What do we make glass from? From what? Sand. If I give you sand now, how many of us know how you can make glass from sand? They make glass. Ikiyo tunajiangalianga nayo hapa from sand. And in your village you have a lot of sand yet you are poor. You step on sand. <laughs> When you have a need for a soul, God will give you inspiration. Do you understand what I'm talking about? So soul winning is the beginning of inspiration. That is not an idea. The idea you have been thinking is because of you are thinking about yourself. That's why they never go anywhere. So, I pray I expect something to enter your heart in Jesus name to make your eyes to see something in Jesus name. May you are here hear something in the name of Jesus Christ. But through the wisdom of soul, soul what? Please engage in this platform of soul we kuvuta watu kanisani. Utapata akili sana. Utajua mambo mengi. Utatatua hata shida zako. You will solve even many problems by soul winning. By what? I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. Every soul you carry has an investment that if you tap on it, it is worth to you. Every soul you carry has an invest. If you tap on it, it is worth to you. When I was buying Henry food in Java, it was not like this. But I need to win this war soul. Hallelujah. He ate the food and I paid the bill. Hallelujah. It was okay. I took the case also to Java. He ate the food and I paid the bill. It was okay. The guy is, I took a, a clapper to Al Yusra. She ate the food. First one, this one ate. <laughs> She ate. I was like, "Hey, madam, slowly." Hey. <laughs> hey. Madam scared me that day. I look at her. I said, like, "This is a true lawyer girl." Hallelujah. No jokes. No formula here. She's. You think she's tapping small, but she's eating, my friend. I was just observing her like this. I said, "Wow." You do know if I get close to you, I must take you out one or another. Is it true? Just to see how you are. Now, how you eat, it makes me know my investment will be better in the future. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I took Arnold somewhere. Hallelujah. Only for there's no need of taking him anywhere. I saw the way he was eating Kugali in my house. I said there's no need. My bill will go high. Let me just take the house. With me. <laughs> You're laughing. Hey, Kirapa, wow. I've never forgotten Al Yusra. That's the first time I met. I sat down with her. I bought for her food. Say madam and she finished I ordered tea also she ordered tea she was in the same frequency <laughs> But Ekira has taught me many things do you know that this girl has taught me many things she has inspiration are we clear I, I got inspiration by winning her soul okay why you are poor is because you have no inspire you are looking for an idea just win her soul you'll get ideas start winning souls to church One of the fish must have the coin. Are we clear? One of the fish must have what? Just be consistent in winning souls, bringing them to church. Sit with those souls that you're bringing to church. Dickens ate that day like a very intelligent guy. Do not even tap anything so much. Just as I want tea. Oh my God. He's very humble about. Then you remember that Java near the door where we sat. You, you know, oh, you forgot. I remember everything. I remember. Wow. He ate food. I told him, can you no, he took tea. Said so don't to I trust him can get cake and everything. Hey, Kirapa is the only one who does not disappoint me. 
It's a man of God. I didn't know about because we like food. Bring the menu. Uh, the girl took the exam properly. Hallelujah. After the exam, he said, I want this and this. What, what did you order, by the way? Biryani with chicken. Wow. And she finally finished with G cappuccino or whatever it is. I don't know what's that thing. That small cup of G. She said, I love so much. That thing was expensive, but she doesn't care. <laughs> I've taken colleagues out. Hallelujah. I've seen how he doesn't joke with Ugali and fish. <laughs> I took him to Ronaldo. Hallelujah. I said, my son. He told me, how does he work? I said, here, you order based on your price. He said, first of all, I know I took him to traditional artifacts. Are we clear? Traditional. Oh, Collins is not waste money with chips, okay? Any woman who comes to Collins, I tell him, first of all, do you know how to cook brown Ugali? No, go away. Go learn. Go learn, first of all. So she took my nagu. She said, Will you take? I said, I'll take with you. Said, what do you want to go? I, I don't order the way I don't even want that. And they said, If you're finished, we can add you gali and boga. They said, They can add testimony. Hallelujah. <laughs> when I finished my own, he told them, Madam, can you add me more? <laughs> I said, I have a proper guy here. I am I'm telling the truth. If I need to blow anyone, I'll carry Collins. If I'm full, he will take care of me. That's why I carry a crap. I know my system can be taken care of. Hallelujah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> leave uh, leave DKC and the the oldest intelligent man around me. Amen. Yeah. Only if I keep him at home for clearance and for don't, don't throw food. <laughs> okay, what am I trying to say? Ukivuta mutu napata nini? Inspiration. Now, Collins is teaching me something. Are we clear? I, I'm always observing. You know, me, I'm, I love, love, me, I love being a student. I love learning. I, I love it. Mm. Arnold was very cool he, when I was out with him. He took that chips. So he, he didn't have any other things. Arnold is very relaxed. He was just busy asking me questions and tapping them. But no one was tap your kitu. You know, kuna, kuna gifting, like, you know, kuna there was a gift around. But it was a very nice conversation because he asked very fundamental questions. Are we clear? Wow. So if you have not gone out with me, you must plan for it. Amen. I've taken Teresa and Justine out. Hallelujah. Teresa, I won't talk about you. I won't talk. I, don't, I fear taking Emmanuel out. If I see a kidnapper like this, Emmanuel can clear me. <laughs> What am I to say? God has inspired me through them. Are we clear? Do you understand what I'm saying? God has inspired me through? Through them. Through them. Through them. So you want God to give you inspiration, a divine idea, how to start a business. Are we clear? What kind of model you can have? Soul winning is the way out. Amen? Express something to enter in your heart in Jesus' mighty name. Genesis chapter 3 verse 21. Wow. Are you learning something here? Yeah. That's why I'm a wise person. I know what to do to get things. I just call you and I listen to you. I'm a very intelligent. I just listen to you. Mm. Wow. Amen. Genesis 3.21. What does it say, please? Genesis 3.21. And to Adam, also, and to his wife, did the Lord what? God made coats of skins and clothed them. Jesus, God wanted to win them back after their fall. Are we clear? Remember, they were covering themselves with leaves. Are we clear? God is the first inventor. He designed coats and skins for them. Is that not amazing? Is it not amazing? You want to be, uh, want to work in inspiration? Be a soul winner. Think on how you can save someone from falling. God will teach you how to, to do great things. Wow. So the song, the design, the cooking, the engineering, the performance, you name it. 
isn't for you as much it benefits you alone. Are we clear? The day you start saying, I want to feed my man of God every day, you will be very good in cooking. Is it true? Because you can't do it for me the same thing all the time. No, yes, I don't want it. You'll be very creative. You'll be very what? Very creative. You'll be creative. I pray the Lord will help you in Jesus' mighty name. So what is hindering inspiration in this rate is the rate of selfishness. Tell about selfishness. Tell about stop being selfish. Can we go out and win souls so that we may gain inspiration? Yes. I, the things I learned about music here is because of the people who came and joined music. Are we clear? Uh, soul winning, soul winning. Soul winning teaches you a lot of things. Second Timothy chapter 3. Timothy Apili. Second Timothy chapter 3. Soul winning inspires you. Hallelujah. Inspire? Inspires. The day I knew Justine was a good drunkard is the day we went out to Galitos. The way she drank that smoothie until there was no form. All the forms disappeared. I said, this woman can drink. That's the day I knew she can love sweet things. And that's how I knew it. You no, know, if you drink the smoothie thing, bubbles remain. There was no bubbles. The thing I said, I said, this one has talent. I said, this one. I just kept, now I was looking at their container. They didn't, now I always observe a lot. Food is the only thing that can reveal to you people. Food. You see someone eating without washing their hands. Know their ability. Are we clear? So there, I love her so much. So there, when I gave her money, I told her to go buy snacks for herself. I told her to write for me the list of things she loves. I gave her money. I said, go just go buy snacks. You serve me well. Thank you. God bless you. Yeah. So just go buy snacks. I don't know if she bought snacks for all that amount of money, but I know she bought snacks. I know that she, she was so happy. Hallelujah. The way she left that door smiling with me, I said, hey, today if it was going to paradise, she would have exchanged herself for me. Say, God, just take him for me. <laughs> Inspiration. Inspire? I have learned many things through Dickens. Are we clear? If I've not, if I never won Dickens, I would not have known what I know right now. Are we clear? You understand what you care about? It was Jeff who helped us know about this whatever thing. Are we clear? What is it called? Uh, this card. What do you call it? Uh, for sound. That it makes it clear. A sound card. You say, okay, man. You know, that's things you learn from people. The soul you win is what gives you inspiration. But when you are selfish, you just want to be achieve yourself. God will not bless you. F draw people to church. God will give you an idea. Are we clear? Yes. Draw people to church. Bring people to church. You see how God will give you inspiration. Second Timothy chapter 3. Are we there now? <laughs> God bless you. Hallelujah. I know. I know. I know. Teresa loves chapati. I, it's favorite food. Chapati. Yeah, yeah, please, anyone who has been trying to talk to Teresa, just buy chapati. Wherever I turn like this, say chapati, she will follow you. Hallelujah. This know also that in the last days, periods and shall what? Shall come. Verse 2, what does it say? For men shall be what? Covetous, proud, disobedient to parents, and holy. Jump to verse 14. I pray God will help us in this area in Jesus' mighty name. How many of us will you say to be soul winners next year? At least you will try to win our soul. I'm telling you, this is what will give you divine ideas. Reach out to your friend in primary. Reach out to your friend in high school. Reach out to your friend in university. Reach out to your friend at work. Tell them, come out to come to church. Reach out to your friends where you live in. I want you, you will see how ideas will come. God will give you more ideas. He says, but continue the what? In the things which not. And how has been what? Knowing that to of whom thou hast what? Verse 16, 15, sorry. 15 says what? And that from a child which are able to make thee what? And to salvation through the faith in Christ Jesus. In Christ Jesus. 
Verse 16. What does it say? All scripture is given by what? Of God. And is profitable for? 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 Uh-huh. We continue, we continue the last verse, verse 17. He says what? That the man of God may be what? True. And to all. So the moment I'm selfish, God cannot perfect me as a man of God. You want God to perfect you? Don't be selfish. Don't be what? Think about what kind of design you can come to make the church beautiful. You'll see how you can get business out of that. You will get business easily. It's an easy, I don't think it's an easy thing. I don't know why people complicate things. It's such an easy thing like this. Everything we have attained here so far is through our soul that came to this church. The business we have in Kamura is through Dickens. We go to start it. The hotel that is running here is through Esther. What we start next is through someone. There's no, listen to me. People are holding treasures. Are we clear? People are holding what? Unless you win that soul, you are not qualified for inspiration. You keep on saying, Mungu nipe idea. Mungu nipe nipe idea. You need idea. <laughs> you never get it. Win a soul. Are we clear? Like now I've seen many people here who can cook. I know I can start a bigger restaurant. I've seen how people here love cooking. I've seen how people are good cookers, cooks here. I've seen. I've just seen. I was just I mean, I was saying, Mommy, I've seen some people when they finish school here. I think I'll make them direct chefs. They will not even go to any school. They will start in the school of the kitchen. Hallelujah. They they can cook. They have the they have the patience and the capacity. Hallelujah. Yes. But if I take candle in the kitchen, I'm wasting time. Everything will turn black. Amen. Even the sufuria. <laughs> ah, hallelujah. Amen. Wow. So we lack inspiration because we don't think souls. Tell you about start thinking souls. As a kufikiria mioyo. Hallelujah. We think ourselves all the time. Mungu nipa idea. God is saying the idea is next to your neighbor. Just win them to Christ. That's all you need to do. I pray as we engage in this wisdom of soul winning, we shall start enjoying inspiration of divine idea in Jesus' mighty name. So anywhere there is good and great works in an environment, that environment thinks souls. So there is no wisdom outside soul. When they built the hotel, they were thinking about a person. Is it true? They knew a president of a country will come here. When they are building the expressway, they knew that some people want to beat the traffic. Is it true? Every divine inspiration is because of a particular person. It's not because of you. The kind of design you will see tomorrow, the kind of cameras you see tomorrow, is because of that. Jesus was explaining to me about lenses when the office told me why you, the camera is the lens. You need to change the lens. And was, she explained to me some lenses take this kind of photos can take this, can take droplets. Are we clear? Uh, so I learned, I learned something. So I knew, oh, so if I need to change the camera, I don't need to change it. But there also there are some lessons which are compatible with this camera. Are we clear? I said, ah, I didn't know. But you want an idea. I want to be a photographer. God, uh, then you say, God has given an idea to be a photographer. You buy a cheap photographer that if you take even photos, the person looks upside down. You, you, uh, people will not buy you from you. When you care about souls, you learn a lot. Are we clear? When you care about souls, you what? Go for souls. Go win souls. I don't know who tell me you See how God will bless you with ideas. I'm telling you, you'll be surprised how many ideas can come away. So many ideas will come to your way. Hallelujah. You want to work with rich men, start taking care of me. Hallelujah. You see how rich men will come towards you. Hallelujah. Because I love expensive lifestyle. You know, I'm the one who can, you can look at the bill. If you're not careful, you'll play in terms. Hallelujah. Say, hey. Rashe, Rashe. Man of God, let me come. The God is calling me. <laughs> I'm not telling you, say, yeah, I am. I say, pay the bill. Hallelujah. Inspire? Eh? I went to the river to Fugogaucho. You know, Fugogaucho, the meat is everywhere. You just stand, put meat. Nakatunyama, any meat you want to eat. 
That's when I knew people can can eat meat without beer. Hallelujah. So beer does not go with meat. Meat goes because you are meaty. Hallelujah. The man eats meat. So this year, Christmas, I said, I want to take my, it's part of my family, is my son. I'm the parent. Hallelujah. I don't know how I'll pay dowry, but look for your dowry. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> I told him, Baba, where do you want us to go for Christmas? He said, Daddy, we go for Kakaocho. I said, You're joking. You're not going for Kakaocho again. <laughs> There's an inspiration came through there. Hallelujah. Inspiration came what? Inspiration came through. I pray inspiration will come to you in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. So what is the difference between a normal idea and inspiration? Tafauti ya fikira tu za kawaida na iyo mongozo ni nini. Tuangalia kazi kaza Job 32 verse 8. Job 32 verse 8. So this church will be beautiful by inspiration. Okay. I think me and Miriam will focus on buying flowers next year here. Yeah. Do take your disciples. Before you buy, someone buys for you flowers, buy flowers for the God. Hallelujah. Mm. That's God delivered you from Smokey and my boys. Hallelujah. So. <laughs> hey, Kirapa is the one who has taken the mantle. Hallelujah. <laughs> Powerful. She's doing a good job. She does not disappoint destiny. Job that you never said. Job 32 verse 8. I, I, I learned about painting. Just because people came here. Even this wall. You know, I've learned small things because of people around here. Are we clear? There are things you cannot learn by thinking about yourself. Are we clear? Being with the men there, I've taught many, many things. I've learned something about machines, about building. I've never known. We were driving coming from Kuroi. The men were there. They already started talking about a wall. It will fall down. Ask them, how do you know the wall will fall down? I, I passed there. I did not even think about I was with Henry and Max. So none of us thought the wall could fall down. Souls carry ideas. Souls carry what? That, uh, you see, if I was a good person, uh, I would have gone and told the man, the wall is about to fall down. Uh, give me the business of making a wall. Do you know that? That's how you get business. People carry what you need. Job. He says what? Lakini akika imo nini? Ronda ni ya nini? Na pumzi ya mwenyezi ndipo payo nini? There is the spirit in a man and the inspiration of the almighty. Inatoka minguni. Every time you show God you are care about souls, God will give you ideas. Eh? If you are a soul winner, you will always know what to do. Are we clear? If you are a soul, what? So, number one, tafauti ya kwanza ni nini? Hii ya kwanza, inspiration comes, inatoka kutoka kwa mungu, ingine inatoka kwa kili yako. Hallelujah. It comes from the spirit, inatoka kwa roo, na ingine inatoka kwa kili ya? Yoni tafauti ya kwa? Ya kwanza. Inspiration comes from the spirit, but your own idea comes from your mind. Your mind is limited. Are we clear? Yes. I will see someone said, I have labeled everything in my house with chemical terms. Amen. <laughs> so if you fail chemistry, you would know which one is salt, which one is sugar, which one is black pepper, <laughs> which one is rice. Hallelujah. <laughs> Everything has left in his house with chemical tar. We don't know because you don't have sodium chloride. NACL. <laughs> what is this? Oh, more America chemical terms. You come and you see H O O C what? I was like, hey! if you don't know that is Omo, <laughs> the mind is li The mind is limited. Second Kings chapter 7. Our family appeal is Second Kings chapter 7, verse 1. May you be a soul winner this year in Jesus' mighty name. So you enjoy inspiring. You have friends in Facebook, in Instagram. Why don't you tell them tune into church on Sunday online? Is it true? So that's another way. Tune in online. They are always just at home. Tune in online. What does he say? Then what? Elisha said, Hear ye what? The word of the Lord. That said the Lord. 
tomorrow about this, you shall measure what? A fine of flour to be sold for a shekel. And two measures of barley for a what? In the gate of Samaria. Elijah had a download because he was taking care about P. Verse 2. Look at this. The boss says what? Can you go to verse 2? Then the Lord on whose hand the king leaned. Pali. Fali my God, I can ask you. As the man of God said, Behold, if the Lord will make windows in heaven, might this thing be? And he said, Behold, thou shalt see it and thy eyes, but thou shalt know what? You are going to feel like you are going to feel like you are going to feel like you are Look at verse 18. Jump to verse 18. Will you be soul winners? Will you be soul winners? I am telling you what will help you. One person you will draw in this church who will give you that job you have been looking for. One person. I am telling you the truth. Will you know someone who, are, who can reward you that contract that can take care of your old years? He says, And it came to pass as a man of God at what? Spoken to the king saying, Remember it was talking to the hand of the king. Two measures of barley for what? And a measure of fine flour for a shekel shall be tomorrow about this time at the gate of Samaria. Verse 19. What does he say? And the Lord answered and said, The man of God said, Now, behold, if the Lord should make windows in heaven, might that such thing be? And he said, Behold, thou shalt see it and with the eyes and what? But thou shalt know what? Verse 20. What does he say? One, two, three, go. Can we read together? For the people trod upon him. Why are you dying? Because you are using your mind. You are not a soul winner. Go for souls. You get inspiration. You build a business. Are we clear? You build what? You can meet up with someone who becomes your greatest business partner in the future. Are we clear? Who will help you do things? Be a soul winner. Be a soul winner. I'm not talking about friendship. I'm talking about soul winning. Are we clear? Soul number two. Yapili. Inspiration. Amaya Mungu. It comes from him. Mungu na nakupa understanding. God gives you understanding. Mungu na nakupa yo marifa. Yo akili. Lakini ya binadamu. Wendo na jipa yo understanding. Wendo wataka kwele? Kwele wa. Umeshino kisoma trade forex. The only year. Nakuna kitu unaelewa. Every time you put money, you are even going on a loss. <laughs> and what are you doing? I'm doing forexing. Umeka usikumzima. Maji mfungua. Umeka takibiriti. Nothing is happening. Uwenu natumia kilia? Kwaelewa. Depend on God. Are we clear? When God gives you inspiration, He makes you understand. Very quickly. Exodus 36 verse 1. Exodus 36 verse 1. Kutoka talatheni na sitem sari ya kwanza. Wow. Then what? Then wrote Bezalel and who? And every wise hearted man. He knew the Lord had learned what? And understanding to know how to do what? For the service of the sanctuary according to all the Lord had what? We are talking about Bezalel and Aholiab right now. The men who build the tabernacle of the Lord. God can use you. The way you are serving in church, you can build a church. You can build something in church. People come to church and ask me, who built the thing? I tell them it is this person. That's how you can get a contract. Do you know that? Yes. Develop security. You guys are in IT. Develop IT platforms around the church. One person will come and say, say who did it? That's how you can get money. What are you good at? God will give you understanding in Jesus' name. And lastly, number three, inspiration. It comes from what? Scriptures. It comes from where? In the talk of Biblia. But these other ide ideas are talking from capitalists. In the capitalist nini, wale watu wamesema tu wamekua matajiri. But they are, the way they were likuwa matajiri so kwa njia ya mu, Unaza kufuata na watu wanye ati uya likuwa tajiri kwa kuchapa mutu ngeta. So you want to kill everyone. You know. Nimesikia ya kwaze iyo ina ingine ataka kwa biblia. Kwa biblia. Lakini ingine itoki kwa biblia. 
Inatoka kwa watu. Inatoka kwa nini? Kwa watu. It comes from people. We call them capitalists. We call them what? I will never follow a capitalist to make it. Thank God for every person who is billionaire and everything. But do you know who are capitalists? These are people who have set economic and political system in which trade and industries are controlled by small private people. Inflation in a country is caused by people. Few people. Do you know that? That's what uh, Collins is studying in school. To become a capitalist. I pray God will make him a scriptural person. Amen. Amen. Few people are controlling the whole economy. Then you think that's how to be rich? They are called capitalists. Stand with the scriptures. Hallelujah. With what? Capitalists are everywhere. Are in organizations. A few who might try to make themselves rich in the expense of others. Are we clear? Yes. That's a capitalist. Yani anakuwa tajiri kwa kumiza watu wengi? Anaumiza watu wengine na kuwe tajiri. Wow. The Lord will help us in Jesus' name. As we conclude, how do we get inspiration? Unapata aji sasa hii nini ya kutoka kwa mungu? Ya kwanza, when you are ready to preach the gospel, kama kwa tayari kubiri injili ya buwana. If you are ready to preach the gospel, if you are ready to preach the gospel, uko tayari kuongea neno la Bwana, Mungu atakupa inspiration. Hallelujah. Katika Mathayo 4, Matthew chapter 4 verse 16 to 17. Kama uko tayari kuhubiri neno la Bwana. Niache ni niende, nikahubiri injili. Niache ni niende, nikahubiri injili. Na na limba hiyo imbo. Mimi limba kani kwa primary onyio atutadotcom poleni sorry i forgot jojo watu kuimba hii kwani shule ndio kwa na watu wa Mungu ah ile tulimba hiyo niache ni niende nikahubiri injili niache ni niende nikahubiri injili sema niache narudia tu haleluya haleluya Watoto wanapotea sababu ya densi niache ni niende hallelujah <laughs> amen wazee wanapotea sababu ya morotina <laughs> niache ni niende amen oh, eh? hmm? hallelujah i think one do many want to show you my songs i sung in primary i think you will like them you will enjoy them hallelujah wow we are saying, leave me, go and preach the go. Matthew chapter 4 verse 16. He says what? The people which sat where? In darkness saw what? And to them which sat in this region of the shadow of death. Light what? How did they see great light? Look at verse 17. What does he say? From the, that time, Jesus began to do what? And to say, repent for the kingdom of heaven is what? what? They saw Jesus, they saw the inspiration. And Jesus was ready to preach the gospel. Hallelujah. When you are ready to preach the gospel, tell people about Jesus, light will come. Ideas will flow. Hallelujah. I saw Justin, there's something I'm working on with that this year. It will come to pass. Inspiration came? Okay? Okay. But I was ready to tell her. I came to see Arnold in the house. Is it true? Justin saw me and said, fall in love. He said, oh, this man of God is hurt. Hallelujah. Yeah? This man of God. He's so young. I was with the kid up and do. There's someone else I was with. Hallelujah. Amen. Arnold, who was I with? There's someone else I was with. Yeah? Just some, huh? Go catch your yeah. You understand? She's so light. And you know she doesn't talk. She came there and sat down and she was just looking at us like this. As if we were giving her some, uh, some whisper. I was ready to preach the God. Glory be to Jesus. You see now I'm doing things with her. Hallelujah. 
inspiration. Are we clear? So when she came, she has inspired me to do something else. Hallelujah. Can you go out for evangelism? Will you do soul winning? Be ready. Tell me be ready. Number two, when you desire to fulfill the word of God, when you do what? Desire to fulfill the word of God. I want the word of God to come to pass. Inspiration will come. Dickens was willing to fulfill the word of God when I tell him to go and serve in technical. He didn't say, Some of you tell you, go serve there and say, Man of God, that's not my ability. That's not my passion. Who cared? I told you to do it. Are you clear? Learn something. See what he's doing right now. He did, he did QS. He's not even in QS. He's in audiovisual. Or the sound engineering. He didn't do sound engineering. He has been just, he just moved. That's where he's making our money from. Or now you'll be writing how many metals have been supposed to be bought. Amen. How many bags of cement are needed? <laughs> but God has sent him from the quantities of it. Is it true? Service. Be ready to fill the word of God. Hallelujah. Matthew chapter 5. Ukwa tayari kutimiza neno la bwana. Kwa tayari kutimiza neno la bwana. Ukwa tayari kutimiza neno la bwana. Matayo 5:14. Be ready. So, judge if I send you to Sunday school, don't say, hey, just go. Go, 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 serve. Don't complain. Are we clear? Yeah. Don't say, I don't know how to deal with you, then you will know. How will you know that day how you can start a Sunday school? Yeah. Hallelujah. Matthew 5, 14 to 17. Are we there? He says, what? You are what? A city that is what? I cannot be hid. Verse 15. What does it say? And put it under what? But a candlestick. But on a candlestick. Is it true? And give a light unto all that are in there. Verse 16. Let your light before so that they may see the good works and glorify your Father which is what? Wow. Verse 17. It says what? Think not that I am come to or there. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. Are we clear? You are willing to do the will of God. Then that's how light will come. Be willing. Be what? What I are Stephen and Mamba Moon. Then you to miss the name of one. I talk with Nano so much sometimes. I try to give him some facts. You know, like so that you see that God is very diverse. Are we clear? God is not an angle. Most of us think God is an angle. God is not an angle. God is very diverse. Are we clear? Diverse. Number three. Ya tatu. Kwa kufanya wa muzi. Ya kwamba uteka maliako miguni. By making a decision of laying treasures in heaven. Use your money to build a church. Use your talent. Are we clear? To draw source. One day someone should reach a point to a town. Mulipe gari ya weba watu kutoka town na waleta kanisani bwana. Nye watu wa town mkwa haji bwana. Put treasures in heaven. Pay. You can pay. Isata mwezi. Wow. Matthew chapter 6 verse 22. Matthew sita. Lay your treasures where? In heaven. Every soul you are winning is a treasure in heaven. Are we clear? Is a treasure where? Matthew 6, 19 to 22. Matthew 6, 19 to 22. Verse 19. I've already read that. Eh? Oh, no. It says, Lay not to yourself what? Where moth and what? Do what? And where thieves break through and what? Yes. Verse 20. But lay up for yourself what? Where neither moth nor rats do what? Where the thieves do not break through all? Verse 21. For where your treasure is there will your heart? Yes. And verse 22. The light of the body is the eye. If therefore thy eye be single, thy body will be full of what? 
Focus on soul winning. Tell your neighbor, win a soul next year. Plant a soul. Thank you. Plant a what? Plant a soul. Wow. Daniel chapter 12 verse 3. Daniel 12 3. Daniel 12, 3. Put your treasures in heaven. That's why I use my money to win souls. Are we clear? Yeah, I spend my money. How many will be willing to spend their money with me to win souls next year? Are you sure? Are you sure? <laughs> you say, hey, man of God, I must eat food fast. Spend your time. Spend your energy. Are we clear? Daniel 12, 3 says what? And they that what? Shall do what? Uh huh. Yes. As the stars for. Yeah, imagine you'll be a star forever by winning a soul. Win souls. Win souls, my friends. There's an inspiration will come. Number five. When you love your brethren. When you what? When you love, tell anybody I love you. You may well know I love you. That's number four. Hey, I've seen number four. I've seen number four. Number one, I said what? Number two? Number three? Number four? Oh, no, I skipped number four. Number four is when you are willing to carry the burdens of others. Are we clear? When I'm willing to carry what? If I see any with a problem, I should be willing to solve it. Are we clear? I will get inspiration. Are we clear? When I'm willing to carry the burden of others, of souls. Matthew, ni kama ni kotele kubeba mizigo ya watu. Hallelujah. Ni kwa tayari, ni tapata solution. I'll find solutions for myself. Matthew, chapter 11, verse 3, 30. Matthew 11, 30. Matthew 11, 30. Matthew 11, 30. What does it say? For my yoke, what? And my burden? Light here can be used in two contexts. Those of us who did English. Inezakwa mwangaza. Ama ikwe mizi. But the right light should be, if kama ni mzigo na you're supposed to use L-I-T-E. Little bit of English. Are we clear? You understand what I'm saying? So, this is all about tenses. Are we clear? Am I doing well as an English teacher? <laughs> Some of us skipped English lessons. Now I'm helping you now. <laughs> and I know, I know you are sleeping when the teacher is teaching English. Oh, hallelujah. So, the burden of God can be his light also. Are we clear? It can give you what? It can give you light for your future. You can catch a revelation and you carry burdens. Are we clear? The burden of God can also be light to you. You, you are helping a kid up out there and you think, ah, kumbe, this thing can happen like this. May you carry the burdens of people in Jesus' name. John chapter 1, verse 4 to 9. Your honor. Kwanzaa, John chapter 1, verse 4 to 9. Are you being blessed? May you be a soul winner. Tell me about be a soul winner. To enjoy inspiration. It is wisdom. Hallelujah. It is wisdom. John chapter 1 verse 4 to 9. He says what? In him was what? And the life was? Uh -huh. He carried the burden of people. It became his light. Are we clear? Verse 5. And the light what? And the darkness? Verse 6. There was what? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The same came uh -huh. that all men through him might. He carried the burden. When you carry people's burden, God will give you inspiration. Are we clear? Verse 8. It was not that light, but he was sent to bear witness. John was willing to carry the burden. And lastly, 
I think that's the last verse. Verse 9, sorry. He says, that was the what? Which lighted in every that cometh into by you seeing me going without water can give you a business of selling water, okay? You can be some people are selling water and say, I was in West Africa a few years ago. I saw they have water that are sold in paper. You have ever seen paper, water sold in paper? And the water is like five shillings here. It has already been packed. They call it pure water. It's really pure in that water. Hallelujah. In that paper, you see through. <laughs> in, in Kenya, every water is like 15, whatever. You understand? Why do they do that? Because of the heat. And they say everyone is thirsty. Are we clear? So they repackage the water into small packages. So it's paper like this. You just chew the paper like this and you drink it. It was West Africa, remember? I was in Mali. I went to see my cousin. I, was, I also saw it in Nigeria. I was in Nigeria. I saw it in Nigeria. Lagos. You have been to Nigeria. I've ate fufu. Hallelujah. And gari. And jollof rice. You serious? Jollof rice. And they tell you, are you from here? If you're not from here, that thing will be too hot. It's pepper. It's pepper. Pepe. The ugali, if you manually eat it, it will not be full because it's very transparent. You understand? <laughs> it's so light. Are we clear? You saw what? You know our gully is hard. Theirs is very light. You touch it like this, you you just transparent. You understand? If I think about Emmanuel that and I can say, no, this will not work. I want to kulanga ugali ni mungua imetoa roof. Hallelujah. Kama ugali ya mungua, this is uga. The was cooking for us ugali. Yeah, they tell us if you don't hear the smell, that's not ugali. I, I said Jesus. <laughs> Amen. Carry the bar. The person who came with the pure water business is because he saw the burden of someone. Are we clear? You can be there in Kware. You can come up with new containers that people can buy water with and it's cheap and affordable. Instead of you using 20 liters. Have you ever thought about that? You have never thought about that? Huh? You can buy a big tank, put full of water. Are we clear? Then sell it at a good price. Compare the price you bought the glory and the time when you still make profits. And you tell people I've shortened the distance. You are not thinking. I so I've gone to I've gone there, I've seen how people where people get water. Some people get water very far. Very far. And they pay them cocotene, then they pay them two Is it true? It's so expensive. But you can go put a slab, buy a container, a big drum, put it there. Fill it with water. Just negotiate with the lorry people. You can buy the water from Karen here with the lorry. Come with it, put it. Is it true? Then sell it to the people there. You'll make money. I am just saying. You are not carrying people's burden. That's why there's nothing opening. May you carry people's burden in Jesus' name. Number five, be someone you love your brethren. Tell about love your brethren. Love people. Tell them about love you. Mommy, na kulambotof, na kulambotof. Andy, tell George na kulambotof. Why you don't tell telling George? First, first George chapter two, verse nine to ten. Hallelujah. That guy told me, I love you free. Now go number two free me I said, my free me what? He's free me what? I've forgotten the word. Free me what? So you tell me, who, who knows it? I've forgotten. The boy told me, I told him, I love you for free. I told him, what do you say? I love you for free in Shabbatang. He said, it's in a number two free me whatever. I don't know. Free me what? Free me to me. Oh, oh. I've tried to remember you when I was here. Uh, you see, the people I was with, they don't remember. You, you people should go to school again. Eh? Free me, Timmy. Hey. Free me, Timmy. Free me what? Free me? Tini. Free me, T. Hey. Free me, T. If you're too. Hey, now, Columbus, free me, T. I would tell you, I never know Columbus, free me, T. Ha 
Jesus will come soon, I'm telling you. He that says that he is in the light and neither his brother is what? Is in darkness. Even until what? Verse 10, what does it say? He that loveth his brother abideth what? And there is no occasion of stumbling in. It means he's seeing good things every time and he's moving forward. If you don't love people, God will not give you inspiration. Bend our hearts. Are we clear? Love people. Eh. Na kulamba top frame biti. So. You can up and make sure you remember that, okay? Write it down as a note. I don't know how you write that one now. You can attend a call out. Amen. Number six. Be willing to stay consistent, constant in fellowship. Kubali kuka kila wakati kwa kwa ushirika. Kwa nini? Most of you don't love being in church. I don't know why. Ask your neighbor, why don't you love being in church? What's the issue? Ask your neighbor, what is the issue? Be willing to stay in constant fellowship with one another. Kila saa tunakuwa pamoja. Tunakuwa pamo? Every time. As time avails you, please be around. Are we clear? Let us be together. First John chapter 1, verse 5 to 7. Sabu, you siku, maybe, because I come to meva coffee a flani. Then you'll get a business idea. Are we clear? Are we clear? Yes. Maybe that day, Salome will come with a particular kind of shoes. Are we clear? With his humble about guy. Hallelujah. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. Maybe that day, Anna will come with the Ethiopian girlfriend. Hallelujah. So that's how you can know. Amen. I know last brown skin. Hallelujah. Eh? Wow. Don't worry, I know. They're in Jamaica. First <laughs> John chapter one. Verse five. He says, well, This man is the what? This then is the message which we have heard of him. And declare what? That God is light, and in him there is no darkness at all. Verse 6, what does it say? If we say that we have what? And walk in, we lie. So you cannot say you have fellowship with God and you're walking in darkness. If you want to walk in light, be always in church in fellowship. And we do not know the truth. Hallelujah. Verse 7, it says what? But if we walk in there, as is in there, we have what? You understand? Yes. And the blood of Jesus Christ is son. Those people are not walking in the light. They don't know the power of just being in church can give you an idea. Are we clear? Like there I'm teaching right now. There are things you are hearing. Is it true? I'm teaching. There's things you are hearing. One way or another, there's things you are hearing. Like the next business idea for next year will be going down to quarry. Around quarry. Because I saw something by moving around there. I saw something. I don't know if people have been seeing those things. I saw something. I was just moving around, saying hi to people. I observe a lot, a lot of things. Lastly, number seven, accept the call. Tell anybody, accept the call. Kubali kuitwa. Accept the call of soul winning. How many of us will accept the call of soul winning from today? We shall go for soul winning. Tutenda kuvuta moyo. Accept. Kubali. Amen. First Peter chapter 2 verse 9. First Peter 2 9. Accept the call. What does it say? But you are what? Yes. Remember God has chosen you. Are we clear? You are a what? A royal? A unholy? A peculiar? That you should what? Yes. God has chosen you. Accept to be chosen. Matthew 22 verse 14. Remember not everyone is chosen. Not everyone is what? Not everyone is chosen. Not everyone is chosen. Not, I'm telling you, not everyone is chosen. 
Do you know that some people will not get born again totally? But there are some people who must get born again. You be finding Christ today, remember it's a privilege God looks for you. Are we clear? There are some people who will hear Christ but they will never accept him and they will die like that. They were just not chosen by God. But God says, Cain, have I what? Cain have hated, Abel have loved. God chooses who to love. Are we clear? Yes. So it's a privilege now you're in charge. Don't misuse your time now. God God saved you from death to be here so you can know him. Don't abuse this time. Okay. Matthew. He says what? Uh, verse 14. What are you doing with Caesar? Amen. Yeah, I told you stop capitalist idealists. Okay. Yeah. We are people from the people of scripture. Stop being a capitalist. Are we clear? What does he say? Uh, people are capitalists, yeah. My son. So for many are what? But they are all just like in the mungata fanya okay, attachana to now. You are chosen. You are few to be chosen. Please don't abuse your choice. Kuna to turn a ribu to of it. And God will be tough on you. God will say, I chose you, you rejected me. You rejected me and I chose you. How many of us desire inspiration now? Have you seen how divine idea comes? Have you learned something today? Be on your feet. Hallelujah. Pray that and say, Father, fill me with your inspiration. Lord, make me a soul winner. Pray that prayer. La de bala chandele bo chantarada. E bayan tala da la ba chantere bo Lord, make me a soul winner. Lord, you have chosen me. I want to be a soul winner. I want to enjoy divine ideas, divine supply. Lord, so to re balaga. Make that prayer, please. Make that prayer, please, in the name of Jesus. Make that prayer. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Lord Jesus. Help me, O oh Lord. Lord, I give you all the glory. In Jesus' name I pray. I pray for you. May the Lord help you. May you develop a desire. May you become a proper soul winner. In the name of Jesus. I pray for you. May you enjoy divine inspiration. In Jesus' mighty name. If you have people to announce together for Jesus' word.